Hey, hello everyone, and welcome back to the walkthrough. Let's what, head over to stage two. How did I mess up my words so early in this part? Doesn't matter, this place is beautiful. It is the world of sunset. We got awesome music again. A ninja power up, which is even better. Well, I don't know. You gotta say that this music, it, it's just. Well, at least, at least I think it's pretty nice. <laughs> this particular song, I should say. I am fumbling in my words everywhere, and that is terrible. <laughs> uh, oh, by the way, these mummy guys here, they only attack you if you're facing away from them, so they're kind of like booze in Super Mario games. Um, this music is just so cheery and upbeat. <laughs> oh, maybe I don't need this particular power, because I'm... Yeah, I might have to get in here. Well, I got my power back anyway. I'm just taking powers as I go here because I have no idea what I need coming up, <clears throat> coming up in future areas. Apparently, I'm getting mucusy too. That is not a good sign. <laughs> but what's the, what was the point of that door? You seen that door close? I don't know. <laughs> it was like it was open. Then when I pressed the other switch, shit. Oh, 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 oh! Did I need the whip? Did I need the whip? I'm keeping the whip just in case. Sometimes I need that to pull things towards me. The mom power up just does not do that. And sometimes I should say it does not do justice. And this place is also very weird. I mean, these are castles bobbing up and down in the air. <laughs> but this is Kirby for you. The worlds are really weird and really abstract. Take some time to pause and wait for the for the early. I mean, uh, earliest, latest possible opportunity, excuse me, that you, no, it would be the earliest possible opportunity, so as you don't mess up blowing this stuff up here, otherwise you'll have to go up and return to get those bombs, what do I need in here, um, I do need the bomb power up, because I bet you I need to do this, perfect shot, first try, Woo! and that was the first one, okay, moving on, with our bomb power up. I'm not, I've never really been a fan of the bomb in Kirby games, but this one does again have some more enhancements that make it a lot better to use, like the bomb roll that you got there. You also got more swift bomb drops. The ability to be able to throw your power and throw your bomb a lot easier, like to aim it a lot easier thanks to the arrow. I'm gonna guess it's this one. And this one unleashes the hounds. Yeah. Um. Which one do I want? This one? No. I bet you it's the one closest to those mummy guys then. No, it's not. <laughs> Alright. Oh my. Oh dear. This is not going to end well. Or it'll go perfectly. <laughs> Actually, I probably want to see what's up ahead just in case. I should say, see what's inside these things. Just to be sure that I don't miss anything. Like, for all I know, if I kill these enemies, I'll be able to get all, all this good- Oh, my. <laughs> what? No, I don't want to drop down the ladder. I want to do that. There we go. Nothing? Oh, I have to, oh, I have to completely kill you, don't I? Eek. Okay, just wanted to make sure. Never can be too sure. I'm going to do that. And then bombard these guys. Oh, no, I didn't mean to do that. <laughs> well, I'm just going to run. Because I didn't see anything there. Uh, what else do we have here? More bombs. Don't really need that, though, because I already got my own bomb power up here. I hope this doesn't lock me in, or not. Or, oh, just a boss. Not going to be much of a problem here. Malno, another super slow boss, which definitely favors having a long-range power-up like the bomb here. Bomb is definitely great for bosses, that is for sure. It just owns pretty much every boss in the game. So, oh shoot, I did not mean to be holding a bomb there. I got a little trigger happy with my bombs. See, when you press a button once, it, it, it pops the bomb out, and then you press the button to throw it. Well, when, you, when you're holding a bomb, you know, you can't jump. I mean, you can't hover, excuse me, and that just kind of threw me off there. Oh, I need, need the rock for this. Uh, I, bet, I, bet I, should, I bet you I have to be careful as to which one of those things I destroy, because I bet you some of these are going to block off the pathways, like the uh, Great Cave Offensive first area. Like, I bet you if I hit that one, it's going to block in this area and I won't be able to get to this. 
That's energy sphere number two. Uh, now, just for the fun of it, I'm going to hit that other one. And I betcha it is going to block that area off. <clears throat> now, let's see. Wah! Just as I thought. And you can't go down through these things if you, if you couldn't tell that by now. That's why I'm being very careful about that. And you guys are troublesome little critters. They're always getting in my way with their helmeted spiked heads. Oh, I sense a superpower coming, or I should say a super ability coming up here. The flare beam. Woo! And you can use this to light these suckers up. They are apparently electric powered, even though if you don't have any electricity going to them at the moment, perhaps they are just power control in general. Woo! And that's how you open these suckers up. And we're going to have to use these to open up the area to the black and white gloom and doom area of awesome sauce. So, do not lose your flare beam by taking too long. But have fun with it along the way. You have plenty of time to do so. Come on, I mean, they give you a, a lot of time plus the ability to go back to the start if you should need to reclaim your ability to get to the super secret area of sorts, even though they're not really secret whatsoever since the game practically leads you to these things. Oh, and also as a pro tip for you, get as many of these glowy things on screen as you possibly can before you uh, start your combo attack here, because if you don't get them all in time, they will uh, block your, I mean, they'll reset their glowiness and you're gonna have to do it from the start. And is this, is this a smiley face? <laughs> it looks like a smiley face. Yeah, it is a smiley face of glowiness, nose last. I bet you this is going to open up a portal. Yeah, because that was the largest one I've seen yet. It was pretty extravagant, and usually the most extravagant uh, ability areas, I should say ability sections, are the ones that contain the things that I'm looking for. I mean, these portals, excuse me. And this one. Oh, I recall having a lot of trouble with this one on my first try because I have to aim at these bomb walls from a distance with the spike, well, star blocks, excuse me, and I also have to time it well. You can use your little puffs of air like that to get them as well, but the thing is is that you waste more time doing that than if you were to just shoot a block at them properly like that. And sometimes it's not even possible in some areas, depending on how it's set up. Oh my, oh dear, oh dear. <laughs> um, um, okay, that worked out. I, I wasn't sure what I was going to do there if I, otherwise. I guess maybe I could have sucked those blocks near the bomb block there at the end. Definitely not going to use the stone power up. I prefer the parasol over that because it's more swift. And looks like we've got a moving platform version of the Spear Doomer boss fight. I should say Spear, Spear Doomer electric version boss fight. And you're gonna do your little zappy zap it there at four places. No problem. And why did I do the charge of all things? I'll shoot you, shoot, shoot, shoot. I'm gonna have to, to wait for him to do balls of death. So I can, these things actually, shoot them back at him. Okay, just need one more of those. Uh, I'm gonna charge. Oh, could I? Would I be able to suck that in? I'm not willing to try that, actually. <laughs> I mean, the, the, some energy things you can suck in, the other ones you cannot. I should say most other ones you cannot, so I'm just not gonna take a risk there. These I know I can. Oh, I almost failed at that one because he did that teleport thing, and I wasn't expecting that, but he teleported right into my blast anyway, so it didn't matter in the long run. this is a beautiful area. <laughs> Just look at that nice sunset area. Absolutely gorgeous. Even the background's nice. Woo! And that's the end of the stage. Hold your breath. I are disappoint. I are very disappointed. <sighs>
but at least the stage is 100%ed and I can move on to stage 3. I'm not going to leave the part end off like that, it's only 10 minutes or so in, at least I think, after the cut. Ah, uh, piano solo, so calming in this windy area, ow. <laughs> Unfortunately, Kirby can't be calm when he has enemies left and right. But I can. I can relax and have fun in this place. And avoid guys shooting arrows at me. And hope- oh shoot. That is not good. That is not calming. But alas, I cannot get very angry in this area. It's just too calm. It's too nice. Ah. I could fall asleep. Oh, oh a apparently I, I somehow managed to fall asleep while playing. Probably because this place is so calm. So nice. Do I want the sword guy? I probably do. So I'm gonna take the sword guy. Even though the wind is hindering my progress, I'm still going to take the sword guy and avoid getting blown up by bombs. I probably need the bomb guy actually, because he's right next to the door. So I'm going to take the bomb guy and get blown up myself. Because it's as comfy as acupuncture. Okay, let's just go through the door here and stop the calm act and hope that I didn't... I mean, hope that I took the right power, excuse me. Um, I better have taken the right power, dang it, otherwise I'm gonna, I'm gonna be very disappointed. Oh, I probably just need this to get whatever's coming up in the upcoming areas. Oh, this is gonna be really handy to take care of these cannons. Because I can drop them right out from underneath their posts, and they don't shoot when they're falling either. Oh, 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 there's a bunch of prizes there. No energy spheres, though, unfortunately. Wait, wait, I bet you I should take this through the door. Should not waste it. Oh, I got a key guy. I have a key guy. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Needle guy should probably... Wait, do I want Needle Guy on my trip down there, actually? I probably do because he's right there, so I can do stuff like dropping on enemies while, you know, needling. <laughs> if that makes any sense. Is there is there a, such a, a verb as needling? I don't know, but that was really handy right there, so I guess there is some use for the needle power-up. Oh, 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 oh. I should say some use for the needle power-up as opposed to what I thought. Oh dear, oh dear. Must suck guy in. No, no, no. Grab. There we go. Get the needle for the heck of it again. And get another energy sphere. That was the first one in the stage. Oh my god, this is going to be a long stage. <laughs> Maybe I shouldn't have started this in this uh, part. But so, well, I guess you won't complain anyway. You don't mind the longer part than usual. I'm getting beam, beam guy here. I definitely prefer you over the needles. These guys, I believe, were in... Oh! Kirby 64! And, yeah, needle, needle power-up, great for this. I wouldn't have been able... I mean, <laughs> the beam power-up was great for that. I wouldn't have been able, been able to get in there otherwise. Oh, dear. <laughs> almost got me... Oh! Almost got me there, too. You can trick me. Oh, this might actually be a problem, though. Um... Um... Yeah! That worked out nicely. And... Boop! So the second, good. Didn't miss a thing. And I can avoid clown guy of doom because I still got my beam power up. And why are there plasma cannons around this area? Did they advance in technology on this ancient castle that far ahead of us? How did we not get word of this technology? Anyway, high jump. Woo! very handy for this area as you could possibly tell as you could probably tell excuse me because of the fact that this is an ent entirely vertical area um, which path do I want to take probably this one because it's the harder to take one and yeah there wasn't wasn't anything there oh this one is a really annoying one you have to do this so precisely and so fast 
Okay, this is how it works. You hit that switch to open that that door there, and then you pull that switch with your high jump, which will open that door, but you have to do a high jump and dash over here as quickly as you possibly can. I'll show you right here. Get off it, run. Ah, see how precise that is? It's really annoying to do. Oh, there we go. And obviously you can't get caught in the middle shaft there, otherwise it'll ruin your entire run. But also don't get trapped, otherwise you're going to be really disappointed that you're going to have to restart that area. Anyway, um, I probably want the umbrella. Because eh, eh, once I get the umbrella guy, I will be able to protect myself from stuff above me. So I'm going to... There we go. Well, it's called a parasol. I always call it the umbrella. I guess they're the same thing, basically. Uh, yeah, that's what, that's why you want the parasols, to protect yourself against these guys. Uh, <laughs> I, don't know, I guess it doesn't defeat enemies in one shot, they just protect you temporarily. Nope! Ain't gonna happen, Sir Kibble. Ain't gonna happen. And... Oh my. <laughs> why are you sleeping on that bomb block? That is not going to end well for you. Uh, why do enemies sleep in the worst of places? Oh, yeah, I seen that coming because the wind is like in cross directions there, so I wasn't exactly sure what I was supposed to do. Wait, you can kill these guys? Why didn't I think you couldn't kill them? I've been avoiding them this whole time because I thought you couldn't kill them and, hmm, well that solves that problem. I, I didn't have to deal with those guys at all. And wow, that was a quick respawn rate for that guy. I mean, he was just barely off the screen. Did I miss anything? Hopefully not. Um. Uh, 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 I seen that. Aha! I just seen that little glow peeping in there, and that's the end of the stage. Oh, I guess this didn't uh, drag out the part too long, like I thought it would. That was a lot shorter than I expected. Of the stage. Yes! I finally got it. And I wasn't even thinking about it that time. <sighs> and I got an extra long dance for my supreme victory there. 100% of the stage. I got a longer Kirby dance extended version. And that's the end of this part. <laughs> Hope you enjoyed, and I'll see you then in the next part. You know what I mean.